are given the principal as 5,000 ringgit. The accumulated amount is 8,000 ringgit. And the interest uh, is 8%. Change it to 0 0.08 by dividing by 100. K is equal to 4 because uh, the interest is compounded quarterly. Quarterly means compounded 4 times a year. And N represents the number of years which we are asked to find. Okay, so as usual, we will use the formula S equals to P times 1 plus R over K to the power N K. So substitute the accumulated amount uh, which is given as 8,000. The principal is 5,000. Uh, bracket 1 plus interest R equals to 0 0.08 over 4 to the power N times 4. So shift the 5,000 to the left, we have 8,000 divided by 5,000 equals to 1.6. And then the uh, bracket, we have 0 0.08 over 4 equals to 0 0.02 plus 1 equals to 1.02 to the power 4 N. So next step, we use log. So we put log on the left side and then log on the right side. So we, will, uh, so we have log 1.02 to the power 4 N. So according to the uh, formula, we can take out the uh, power 4N outside here. So we will get 4N log 1.02 equals to log 1.6. So from here, uh, we find the value of log 1.02 using the calculator. So we will get 0 0.00860 equals to log 1.6 is equals to 0 0.2041. Two. So shift this bracket to the right, so we'll get 4n equals 0 0.20412 divided by this, we will get 23.7349. So from here, n will be equal to 23.7349 divided by 4 or 5.9 years. Or we can change this to 5 years uh, and 11 months actually. So next example. Say Ahmad wants to save a certain amount of money in a bank that offers an interest rate of 7.2% per year uh, which is compounded every month so that after 10 years he will have 20,000 ringgit in the bank. Find the amount he needs to invest in the bank. So in this question we are given S equals to 20,000 and P is the principal uh, amount which uh, we have to find. Then R is the interest, which is 7.2%. So convert this to 0 0.072. And K is equals 12 because the interest is compounded every month, which means it is compounded 12 times a year. And the duration here is given as 10. So therefore N equals to 10. Now using the same formula, S equals to P bracket 1 plus R over K to the power N K. So from here, substitute S with 20,000 and then uh, substitute R with 0 0.072, K equals 12, N is 10 and K is 12. So from here, simplify the one in the bracket. So 0 0.072 divided by 12 is equal to 0 0.06 uh, plus 1. So we will get 1.006 to the power 120. So using your calculator, to find 1.006 to the power 120, we shall get 1.12709. So from here, we can find P. So shift this 1.12709 to the left. We will get 20,000 divided by 1.12709. So using your calculator, we will get P equals to 17,745.